Hey guys, welcome back to Tech Talk. My name is Chase. Today we're going to be going over some of the key components of the Seakeeper Gyro and who is best suited for it. On the Open 302, we've got the Seakeeper 2 gyro installed. Now what that gyro is gonna do is when you're sitting still or even at idle, you're in some rough water, it's gonna stabilize the boat and drastically reduce that pitch from port to starboard and even from bow to stern in those rough waves. Um, this is great for somebody who's gonna be doing some, some bottom fishing or offshore trolling, things of that nature. Um, if you're gonna be more inshore, going up and down the intercoastal waterway, going to sandbars and stuff, this might not be the best option for you as it does take up a significant amount of space in your bilge. We do have a designed in pod for it, but outside of that pod, we've also designed in a space for a five gallon bucket. And there's also many accessories that can be added in here after the fact, such as a stern anchor holder, um, fire extinguisher rope, all that sort of stuff can be utilized in there. So really the Seakeeper Gyro um, is an option that would be best utilized, again, for somebody who's gonna be offshore fishing in rough water, bottom fishing, that sort of stuff. Um, to drastically reduce and just the yaw from back and forth, but also make it just a much more comfortable and enjoyable day out on the water. All right, guys, thanks for watching this quick video on the Seakeeper Gyro. We hope it'll help you narrow down whether this product is right for you and also give you a better understanding of what the gyro actually does. If you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them below, like and subscribe. And if you have anything that you guys would like to see, please email us at the address listed below and we'll see you next time.